All right, so this is a reaction or a review on the album Konnichiwa by Skepta. Um, guess what, yeah? This was released on the 6th of May 2016, so this is technically a throwback, isn't it? Um, but yeah, so the artwork is basically like a stamp, yeah? Basically, that's, that's the best way to explain it. It's like a stamp. Um, and yeah, so let's get into the track listing right here, yeah? So there's Konnichiwa, then there is lyrics featuring novelist, get me big up novelist. Then there is Corn on the Cob uh, featuring Wiley and also Chip. Although Chip's not really spitting bars, but he is giving advice to um, to Skepta, which, is, which I find interesting as well. Um, then there's the Crime Rhythm. Then there Ain't Safe featuring Young Lord. Then there's Ladies Hit Squad featuring D Double E and ASAP Nast. Then uh, or Nast. Then there is Numbers featuring Pharrell Williams. Um, then there's the the song Man. Then there is Shut Down. Then there's That's Not Me featuring J M E. Then there is Detox featuring Boy Better No. Boy Better No need a fucking album. They're starting to jar me, bro. Like, do you know how many songs that like the list of songs that they have? Yeah, but they have no fucking album. Are they taking a piss? Bro, I'm annoyed. Then there is, uh, the last track is Text Me Back. But yeah, like, the majority of the tracks were, like, grime. Um, grime, which I respect that he was able to do that on this album. Especially the fact that, um, you know, you got features from the likes of Pharrell and ASAP Nast. Even though a couple of them, a few of them weren't grand, but the majority of it was, and that's what I kind of respect about Skepta. And I was, I remember I was watching um, Half Cast podcast, and um, uh, Chucky and Poet, they were saying how the, the clarity of Skepta. You know, what I mean, I mentioned about his clarity, and you know what's magic? I've always. As far, like, I didn't know about his clarity, but I didn't really know, no. You know what I mean? Like, it's only when you properly listen, you're like, oh, shit, the clarity is mad. Like, every single word you hear clearly. And it's the same thing with, um, like I said, with Nole. Every word you hear, you, you not only hear, but you feel, yeah? You feel every single word. Well, as far as Nole, yeah? Um, with Skepta... I'm not saying I don't feel every single word, but I definitely hear every single word. It's, it's crystal clear. I don't know how he manages to do it, but I'm learning from him as I do these type of videos or any type of video, yeah, where you hear my voice or whatnot. I want to try and be as clearly as possible. And I want to be able to bring that into, as I learn more to do with, learn more Edo language and learn more Igbo language, I want to be able to be clear in pronouncing my words there as well. And there's something else he mentioned as well. Like he also, in one track, he made reference to um, taking it back to the motherland as well, and then working with um, particular type of artists as well. So I respect him for that as well. Because uh, like, it's, uh, uh, maybe you haven't watched it yet, but like, um, or maybe you have. I don't know. But I, I respect when artists reach certain levels, and they're still able to be like, this is the real home. You know what I mean? This is what I really am about. I like that and I respect that. That just shows you that nah, they ain't, they're not going to conform to to maintain a certain level of propaganda. Do you see what I'm saying? But anyway, I'm going to give the album 10 out of 10. Um, also, as usual, I take one song that's in context to our context. It is what it is. And that is... Let's get one song. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Yeah. It ain't safe. Yeah? Because in life, sometimes it can feel like life ain't safe, whether you're a man or a woman. And the reality is you have to kind of live life without fear. I know that sounds crazy, but when you live your life without fear, your mindset is just different. I don't know how to explain it. It's like, it's like you, you turn on another switch in your mind and you start doing things that's like... I'm not saying that it's beyond your character because it is your character, but it's like... You start to reach new levels, basically. I, I don't have to explain it. 
you have to experience it to really understand what I mean. Like, you you really have to live life without fear. Like, I know this, this situation that happened from time to time, but live your life without fear. Do you, you obviously, you do have to be careful in certain situations, but when you're on your journey, you will know how to move and you're not going to move out of fear of, you know what I mean? You move because you're like, all right, boom, this makes sense. This don't make sense. And you won't try to explain that saying, because you fear this or you fear, no, you will just do it because you're like, wait, this makes sense because of this. You know what I mean? Because it adds to this. Not trying to say, anyway, anyway. You don't have to explain anything. Yeah, you don't. You just do what you got to do. But yeah, like, um, if I had to choose one song, it'd probably be Corner of the Cob. Mm, nah, nah. Shut down. Nah, man. I don't know. Leave your answer in the comment section below. What's your favourite track on this specific album? If you were to choose one, just one. Oh shit, ladies, hit squad. I don't even know. It's mad, you know. You know when, when... I can't choose one, this is mad. I can't choose one, but you can. Yeah? So leave your answer in the comment section below. Um, yeah, the link to the, um, to, to live without fear, to put that into your mindset, into your aura. If you click the link in the description box below, you'll get access to online courses such as um, healthcare. You'll learn how to manage your health, your overall health, but learn how to deal with your emotions, your problems effectively. The other thing I'm gonna mention as well is um, the link to this album is in the description box below. And yeah, anything you want to do a review on, do a reaction on, do a video on, go ahead, leave that in the comment section below. Uh, Find us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, all that stuff there. And yeah, um, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification because you never know the video you suggest might just be next.